Hey guys, it's Naz here, bringing you my first Photoshop tutorial. I might be a bit nervous, so go easy on me. I'm going to be showing you how to do a cool image effect like this. Um, it's really effective and simple. It's, as you can see, it's only four layers. Then this is what it looked like before. And this is what it looked like after. So to start, hit Ctrl N or File and New to create a new canvas. And if you copied a picture before doing this, then it should already be the size the same size as your picture so click OK then paste in your picture using control V and then I'm going to crop out the bit that I want by using this crop tool here you don't have to do this if it's already the right size but just select the area hit enter there you go and then next um, I'm going to duplicate the layer by hitting control and J or layer duplicate layer and then on the top layer if you click this drop down arrow you can change the blending mode so I'm going to go to hard light and as you can see this increases the contrast and if you click on the layer underneath and go to filter blur Gaussian blur change it to anywhere between 5 and 10 it's okay then it gives us kind of dreamy look and I'm going to brighten up a bit um, by adding a lighting effect um, so to do this I'm going to go to filter render lighting effect you have to be in the top layer by the way um, then you don't want to mess about with too many settings really I'm just gonna go with the intensity and the focus the intensity is basically how bright the light is the focus how big the light is um, that's okay and if you move this white dot here you can change the position of the light I'm just gonna put it down here really and if you move these black squares around it you can change the size of the light and then that looks okay if it doesn't look good then you can just control Z and try again so if I show you the difference it looked like that then lighting kind of made it glow a bit so next I'm going to add a blur around the edge and to do this I'm going to click on the blurred layer layer 1 control J to duplicate drag the top layer underneath so you have the blurred out layer on top and then I'm going to go to the marquee tool if you don't have this then hold it down go to the rectangular marquee tool then I'm going to change the feather to about 100 pixels that should be alright it kinda depends how big your image is so if you highlight it all then click delete you're left with a blur around the edge which looks alright if you look at the picture that I showed you before it kind of has an orange tint to it and to do this you want to go to this icon down here, the black and white circle, click the arrow, go to photo filter, and then this adjustments tab should pop up, pop up and then you can change the color that you want. It depends what color you want it to be. Um, I'm going to go with an orangey kind of look. Um, then if you turn up the density, then it kind of makes the orange more visible. Um, I'm going to go with about 45 maybe change the color a bit to yellow yeah that looks good and then there you go this has been my first photoshop tutorial hope you enjoyed it if you have any questions just post them or if you want to see any more tutorials then just ask thank you bye